the voltage we need to connect this negative probe to the body these components we will we can check only from the back so these are the connections on this one hello and welcome back to the channel guys uh, this is the third video part three of the video where we started the step-by-step -step guide to see to diagnose the card where is a problem so this is the external PCI uh, connection uh, it's connected with the power supply only and uh, we are actually going to test the card trying to find out the problem and we connect the wires with that to see the current or voltage onto the card. Okay, we turn on the power supply. As you can see the lights they are on and uh, we turn it on with this meter okay then the voltage we need to connect this negative probe to the body and we see the voltage is coming to different points and uh, I suppose this is showing 83 kilo ohms so i think something is not possibly current or voltage let me see the fuses so this is first fuse that seems okay and this is the fuse as well seems fine so fuses seems to me okay but let me see all the components if they are getting the voltage or not so this thing this uh, small part component is not getting voltage how about this yeah, it's getting like you can say 10.48, but this is a 12 volt actually. You can see that it's losing power somewhere. And this part 1.5 volt, so there is a volt. Yeah, so these two are getting voltage. This is getting volt. And the fuse actually passing the power is a 12 volt, so it's fine. We're getting the 8.86 volt on to the next one same voltage third same voltage it's the same voltage same so it's these uh, components they are getting the voltage at least less than uh, one volt I don't know exactly is is good enough or not but as I said before I'm still learning it uh, how about that yeah, it's a 5 volt and Flip over. So these components we will we can check only from the back. So these are the connections on this one. It's getting 12 volt. Yeah. <clears throat> this 
so it seems to me power supply is coming on that side but this is a little bit doubtful I cannot see voltage here so this is it should be I think it, it is 5 volt it should pass the 5 volts at least so I'm not pretty sure as I said before so I think this is five, for 5 volt I need to see that but it's not showing voltage here so the connection or some kind of component is not passing the voltage it could be for the VRAM I think so I'm not pretty sure but it's a VRAM uh, power which is not supplying there so that's why our problem is not showing the um, display on the screen so this is related I I presume because I've seen a couple of videos and uh, the guide videos so it seems to me it could be problem with one of these one of these uh, MOSFETs or let me find out and uh, I'll be in touch thanks for watching Universal Information and Entertainment TV Please like and subscribe our channel for more updated videos, news, information and entertainment, see you in next video. Stay tuned.